Oh, who that shooting? Oh, there you go. Would you be interested in some friendly competition? What kind of competition? All the way north from Mexico to challenge a real American gunslinger. You him? Boy, don't put my gunslinging skills in the question. Hey, real gunslinger? Let's find out. Okay, man. That's what I like to hear. Look, man, rules are simple, okay? Whoever shoots more of these bottles wins. Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready. All right? Oh, you, you sure you ready for this? You sure you ready? It's gonna be real quick. Oh man, I can't mark these. Oh, why they so small? Easy, man. Damn it all. How the hell did you beat me, huh? Cause I'm that good. Better shot, I suppose. Let me let me gear back up on some of this. Oh, that didn't make me happy at Man, nobody care if you unhappy about you losing. You be alright. No. Oh, how about we raise the stakes, huh? Did that not go through? Come on. Could win real big, huh? <laughs> Ten dollar challenge, boy. Aha, that's a good call. Okay? Let's do it. Okay. Whoever shoots four birds out of the sky first wins. Simple enough. Stand near me. And as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah! There they go! Shoot! Man, stupid, stupid! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, so, you can shoot, huh? Yeah, I can shoot. Uh, here it is, okay? Man of my word. Yeah, you better be a man of your word. Appreciate yeah. it. Give me that money. Sure. <sighs> Better watch out next time. You'll see. Boy. Let me go get these birds. They can use this. They can use these birds for stew. Oh, ain't this dude I'm supposed to be coming over here to see anyway? There we go. Oh, you put the whole bird in there? I hear making birds too. Go find this dude. What'd you say about me? Hey, you. What do you want? Howdy. You Granger? That's my name. And my occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. We're not always like that, though, we're. You used to be a quick draw guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be's correct. Then there's a long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? <laughs> well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. You don't mind me. You can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, a young man like you would get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? If you shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. Oh, you don't you be putting your work off on me. You squat. God damn it. These better be some stories. Oh, they are. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Well, get out of here and stop wasting my time. You know what, old man? I do this for you, but I don't like it. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? 
I kill men, women, and children. Oh, that looks disgusting. Oh my god. And I kill them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks, skinned folks. I scalped some. Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. You ain't telling me what I want to hear either. Don't know what's got into these hogs, but I know what's coming out of them. <laughs> I bash folks, butcher folks. I burn folks alive. Bury folks alive. One time, I... I get it, all right? You're mean. What about Callaway? Now it's clean enough to eat off. Uh, I guess I'm done. You get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. All right. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Hope when the pigs come out. That stinks. <laughs> okay, I cleaned up your mask. Go on. Tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't try for what Oh you boy, don't be playing. You knew him, just give me something. Anything. You making a book, you should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me boy, something you... to say and I'll leave you alone. You owe me there. Hey, you be careful. Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One hey, time. You know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I ain't a killer? Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this far. This is your last chance. Oh, you a snitch too? Ranger. Give me a quote for the book. Hey, hey, hey you don't you don't hit no man a piece, no government witness. Look at you, acting like a punk. Galloway said you was full of piss, but he didn't tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girly. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick. Oh, I see where this is going. You walk away right now. Oh, I see where this is going. Oh, I'm definitely doing it. There you go. No. 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 You didn't know. <laughs> oh, you stink. Oh, that's disgusting. You just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, that's real nasty. You earned yourself a killer. And I'm going to enjoy it now. It's gonna be the last thing you do. Slow your fast R2 to fill the meter. Oh no. Nah. Oh no, nah, boy. Was he about to throw a knife at me? We ain't playing them games right here. You better have that pistol ready. Bring a knife to a gunfight, boy. Oh, I gotta take. Oh, what you got on you? Cause you ain't gonna need this no more where you just went. Camera. Uh. Yep. What kind of pigs are these? You know what? Don't even matter. Where my horse at? Oh, what kind of... What you have over here? Oh, yeah. Let me get that gun off you. He over here got a pig hung up. All right, girl. What else is out here?
Who over here? Hey, what y'all over here doing? What you mean they ain't supposed to be here? Oh, these niggas shoot. I just came to see what y'all was doing. And y'all over here busting shots at me? Tag. Somebody up here? Oh, who's that over here? What up? What's the problem? Problem? No, there's no problem. Quite the contrary. Well, there is a problem. For me, but not for you. All right. I ain't got time for No, this. What? no, wait. Give me a minute of your life. I might just change it forever. Oh, yeah? I'm sure you will have heard of me. Who are you? Maximo Cristobal Valdespino, the renowned explorer. What? Yes, yeah, I have. There has been much written about me. You sure? I once had high tea with the Viceroy of India. Never heard I of it. To liberate South America. Who? I've climbed mountains and swum across seas. What? I have had many women. We don't care. I've spent the last three months hunting treasure on the American frontier. Beautiful country. Reminds me a lot of Almeria. Never been but there. Tomorrow I set sail for the island of Shikoku. In the Japanese archipelago. In search of the legendary... Tokushima Sapphire. Well, good for you. No, no, hold on. You see this map here? It was made by the Jack Hall gang. They robbed banks all the way from here to California. Yeah, I know who the Jack Hall gang are. Oh, them you have heard of. But me? Huh. Your bomb. Well, uh, rumor has it they buried gold somewhere in this area, but were killed before they could retrieve it. They created two maps to ensure it was well hidden. This is the first and should lead you to the second. You just need to follow the landmarks drawn here. Me? Yes. Unfortunately, I am out of time now, but I am prepared to sell it to you for the low price of ten dollars. A trifling investment for a man such as you, given the potential returns. How much money I got anyway? All right, all right, uh, whatever. What the hell? Why not? A very wise investment. I wish you the best of luck. He was over here looking at the map from here. Let me see what this map looked like. I have no idea what I'm looking at. Ain't that the church from Valentine? All right, whatever. My horse at. We had stuff to do. Oh, who that shooting? Let me get the big guns out because I'm low on ammo. Oh, they said old Driscoll's? Oh, no, nah, let me get him. Top of seat.
What about the one that? I'm gonna tell them all about you. They ever come out here. What you got on your Driscoll? Let me get that off of you. You ain't gonna need that. Who are you? Oh, you want no Driscoll too? Let me, uh. Nah, I'm a hog tie you. I ride with Colomon Driscoll, you fool. Oh, I know you ride with him. I just wanted to let you, I just wanted to see what you was gonna do, and I figured you was gonna run. Hog tie. Get these damn ropes off me. Nah, you be alright. So, you stupid clown for cold on. Man, what you call me? Man, you about to get stomped out. Oh, I can't stomp him out. Oh, I can shoot him though. But nah, that ain't, that's not fun. Well, nah, I can't have him snitching. I can't have him snitching. How your boys come after me. Oh, dang, I ain't even see him sitting there. Hey, okay, there, girl. Okay, girl. Oh, who this over here? Hey man, who are you? I don't know. Hey, mister. Oh. Hello. Why the day, isn't it? Beautiful sure. day. What a country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Oh yeah? Well, that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture. A grumpy housefrau or pompous middle class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. You wouldn't really do that. Here? Just. There. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Good luck with that. Yes. Not the easiest, but well, I love a challenge. I bet you do. The trick is to leave a big load of meat and relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens, my bag, that thing is robbing me. Go, oh, good heavens. Don't worry. Oh, what was that, a fox? Oh, it's Coyote. Boy, he run in slow motion. Oh, come here. I ain't playing games. I ain't even gonna play with you. I ain't chasing you around this thing. You can give me this bag. How do you run like that? Not even like he running. Well, well. Got your... Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. Bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I can't thank you enough. I'm, I'm, thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm, uh, you take care, sir. 
I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. <laughs> Forgive me. Much of a Thank fool. Very much once again. All right, where my horse at? Let's go, girl. Yep. You know what? Ain't that fox still over here? Hey, y'all get away from the fox. Get off the horse. Man, I ain't saying I'm not hitching the horse. Ah, uh, they already don't tow him up. Oh well. Oh snap. Come on, horse. Are you serious right now? You're gonna be okay. Horse out here tripping. Hurry up. Get up. Okay, girl. Get up. Horse don't sound too good. See how things lie. Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah, pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Oh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean? I wonder. I think he's bait. Well, they want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up and up on Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. We can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. I'm not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skelding's boys are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Oh, yeah? So, well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. People always say it's a big country, but yet, always end up getting caught. Oh, 
Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. Down there. Reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Hey man, watch out. Guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Another straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Yeah, I don't like how you talk. Let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. I couldn't trust nobody that talk like he do. It's like he thinking of a lie. Right on the spot. Push up, come on. Apparently there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. They just stop over there in the corner. Look, they've stopped. All right, let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Got an idea, huh? Move out the way. All right, what are we doing? We should do this quietly if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. <laughs> down sneak across and do the dirty on them. Man, I got this. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen, gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers. 
My wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Where is she? Okay, come on. Stay low. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. Ah, oh, I took the wrong one. <laughs> okay, let's get after him. Come on, we got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. Oh, you ain't gonna help out? Oh, I didn't know I'm here. Sit down. Dang, I can't shoot for crap. Oh, somebody right there. Fill him up. Ah oh, man, I gotta reload. Ah, oh, missed it. Yep, have a seat. Goodbye. Where? I see Charles up there. Quick. Come on, let's get up there. I have no idea where I'm going. Two more, look out. Where? Now back up. Back up. Camps up this way. Come on. Where? I'll take the left side, Charles. You go right, okay? I guess. Take him down. Ah, oh, jeez. Goodbye, Tower Man. You gone? Should just leave you out there hanging. Look at you. Arthur. <laughs> you know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do we get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know. Nothing means more to me than this gang, the bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. <laughs> Arthur Morgan, the kind of young whippersnapper I can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles pissed you right separately. 
Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Oh yeah, get the loot, okay, these boys. <laughs> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine y'all missed me a lot, but fear not. The joy's back in your lives now. Boy, hearing you talk, I don't think they miss you at all. Let's see what's over here in this camp here. Anything worth taking over here? What's that? Hey man, horse back up. Trying to see what's right here for the taking. We got some moonshine over here. Oh wait, them cigarettes got them cards, don't it? Let me get rid of... Yeah, we don't smoke right here, homie. Not no cigarettes. Who else around here? Who reported a crime? Well, time to go. Yep. 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 All right, horse, go. <laughs> Where else can I go? What's next? Uh, I guess I can go to Micah. I don't want to save him, but I guess I got to do it. So why can't What you mean return at a later time? You know what? Cap out time. Oh, ain't that a hotel? Hey. Damn, maniac. What do you think you're doing? My bad, lady. Please leave me alone. I'm trying to move my horse. I'm trying to move my horse. Sure you did. Show did Magnolia. Got me out of there. Got me out of there real good quick. Yeah, let me I need a wash. I wouldn't All right. Head on over when you're ready. I wasn't trying to take a bath, I was trying to get a room. Yeah, we gonna sleep till uh they let us do this do this Micah mission. Once the whole area is timber, it's not like people can't hunt elsewhere. I don't care. I'm leaving. Thanks, Mister. Hello. Hey, 
Hey man, you got my homeboy Mike up in here? Well, he ain't my homeboy. Yep. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. Home O'Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. We got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. All right, then, fair enough. I see what you mean. All right. Oh, that sounds just like him. Now what you want? Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you going to get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Leave me in there. I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. It's a long six months. I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Watch a hang, boy. Something. Well, I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, oh, really? Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. Are you begging? You got any dynamite? I might. No, I do not. Oh, well. You're out of luck. You're out of luck. Steam donkey. Yes. Hook that over the bars. See if you can pull them off. Uh, I guess I am saving him. What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. Dang. He wasn't O'Driscoll. They gave you every reason to shoot him. I knew you were scoping when I laid eyes on you. Oh, I'm gonna get you next. Come on, oh man, how many of them is it out here? I have no idea who I'm shooting at. Man, what business could you have done? What unfinished business could you have? Yeah, we should have been out of here. Oh. Crap. 
I ain't looking too good. Oh man, I'm out of bullets. Get in the cover. Get in the cover. What are you doing? Where are you at? Let me heal up. Okay, so you just shoot the man to go in the house. Dang, for real? Finish him. You started this. Oh, now you want to leave. Now you want to leave. We don't circle the whole town. Missing him for real. Get up out of here. Okay. Woo. Let's get out of here before we get any more on our tail. We literally just shot up a whole town. Good shooting, Morgan. I gotta hand it to you. What the hell was that you pulled back there? Got a bit wild, all right. Wow. Making a house call in the middle of all that. Ain't much I care about more than those guns. Clearly. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely, I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. For some unknown reason. A fool crazy. Whoa there. I think we finally lost. Well, I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up. By letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. Why you act all sour all yeah, the time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now, Arthur. I don't have to claim you. 
and me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. I want to claim me. Brothers make mistakes. Not like that. I'll that was a big one. My little camp around back of strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah. Alright, that was interesting. He gone that quick. Ah, oh, damn, town is on lockdown. Oh yeah, I'm definitely not going back. Oh yeah, definitely not going back right now. <laughs> 